course, we're still supposed to be social distancing, but that advice was obviously not being followed this weekend. And doctors are worried after thousands of people converged on downtown. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen talked with an infectious disease expert who has a warning for protesters. In a time when large scale events are being canceled left and right on Saturday, thousands of protesters were all here in downtown Nashville pretty close together. Justice for George Floyd. These Nashville streets were suddenly filled with a swarm of protesters. In some instances, social distancing rules went out the window. During this time of a pandemic, it's really important for people to do their part yeah, even when they're in crowds to try to limit the risk of transmission of this virus. Dr. David Aronoff is the director of the Division of Infectious Diseases at Vanderbilt University Medical Center. He says doctors are concerned COVID-19 positive numbers will go up following the rally and protests. And we'll be watching our hospital bed capacity and seeing if we start to see more patients coming to the hospital. He says if you were a protester, it wouldn't hurt to go get a COVID-19 test. It may take a few days, from when someone gets infected for them to be shedding enough virus to be um, detectable by current diagnostic tests. So if you plan on going to an upcoming rally or protest, Dr. Aronoff recommends taking measures to stay virus free by wearing a cloth mask and bringing hand sanitizer. Well, I think if people are going to find themselves in crowds to really do the best that you can to maintain social distance. Reporting in Nashville, Alexander Cohen, News Channel 5. Thanks, Alex.